if I take a look now and switch over and say go into uh, say solid edge solid edge I log in and I get the same fly out over here you know this particular case there's the dump truck that was made inside of NX but I can still look and look at the data that was associated with it I could also look at uh, other you know solid edge data if I needed to so I know that my solid edge data now I've got a motorcycle in here I've got a fork assembly that I can look at you know that was created within within solid edge I can quickly go in and search for what I need to find I can go and open it up if I need to you know this solid edge assembly I can you know open it up inside solid edge load it up this becomes my U interface you know instead of going file I can still go file open file new but you know I can quickly get to the information I need to get to if you know if I was part of a workflow again I could quickly search in my inbox you know if uh, there was a you know court and you know if they had to make a change to any one of these parts or if I had an engineering change order waiting for me I could go ahead and interrogate that part still participate in the workflow you know take a look at my engineering change order what was a part of it if somebody if I had to move say I had to make a change to the yoke you know what was the change request you know why why did it need to change you know there's some corrective action if somebody you know even even if it's some non CAD data you know if say I had a, a PDF that I wanted to look at I could simply use my interface over your directive workspace you know find a PDF or say if it was part of my engineering change order you know say I need to move this up you know 15 millimeters and review it I could do that all within you know, if I had my viewer set up, you know, I could view the actual PDF or if I had a compatible ver I've got Office 365. So if I upgraded my active workspace and everything, I could have the actual document load up over here on the right hand side. I can view it all within my CAD tool, my native CAD tool as it is here. So you create a lot of functionality. You, you maintain all the bells and whistles that you get out of... Uh, out of uh, active workspace through the HTML file I mean through the HTML web portal you integrate that all within your CAD tool and you in essence you don't really have to leave your CAD tool if you don't need to if you're that's all you're working in so it gives you great functionality on that part